CDC says healthcare providers and nursing home residents are expected to receive first choice when it comes to a coronavirus vaccine once it is approved for use in the U.S. It's already been given the green light in the U.K., but as medical reporter Liz Bonus shares, some people are hesitant to get that vaccine. We are likely within days of emergency use authorization for a COVID-19 vaccine. If the FDA grants this use, the Pfizer vaccine could be rolled out by the end of next week. Moderna likely to follow soon after. The question, however, isn't just does it work to stop the virus, but rather will you choose to get it? A couple of the biggest studies show between 35 to 50 percent of Americans say they won't take the vaccine. The vaccine won't help save lives unless enough of us get it, so most of us are immune to the COVID-19 coronavirus, and it won't spread. That's called herd immunity. But you need the vaccine to shorten this time period, to shorten the, shorten the number of deaths. Dr. Odell Owens runs an organization called Interact for Health. They conduct community surveys related to our health and wellness. And, and I think there were people just waiting for good, honest science and good, honest people to say it's safe. While well, those good, honest people with the FDA and the CDC have been following early vaccine trial results, Dr. Owens points out one of the biggest barriers for many people to feeling like they want to get this vaccine is this. We haven't seen the safety data yet. And, and even though it's probably going to pass that, we know there's going to be some individuals that will have a reaction to it. And then that's going to be blown out of proportion. And that's going to further put people back on the line, away from the line in a sense. So I put this on my Facebook page just out of curiosity and got an overwhelming response of sort of, no, I won't get it, and you first. What do you think that's about? It seems like it's going to work, but we don't know if it's going to work for everyone and for how long. He's right. Many people who responded say they simply want more time to evaluate what happens long term. I'd love to have you share your thoughts on my Facebook page. Go to the Liz Bonus page. Let me know whether or not you will get it and maybe why or why not. The hope is that we'd like to continue to answer some of your concerns with sound science as it becomes available. Operation Warp Speed, which is the federal program launched to get a coronavirus vaccine to market, has said it will be transparent with the data. Once it's available, if you have questions about it, the best person to ask about your personal benefit versus your personal risk is your own health care provider. I'm medical reporter Liz Bonus. We'll throw it back to you.